Hello, I am Mark Thatcher, and I am going to demonstrate Evasoft's right-click function. I can select an image and right-click it, and a little menu comes up. For example, I could click on full screen, and the image will go full screen. The first menu item when you right-click an image is send image. This is to send the image somewhere. For example, I could hit print image and send it to a printer or I could send it to a different patient had we taken x-rays under the wrong patient's name by clicking transfer image. I can select on the drop-down menu a different patient for where I should send the image to. I could also select copy so I could then paste it into a PowerPoint presentation or into a Word document or elsewhere. If you're using Microsoft Outlook, I could click on send email and it will automatically create an email in Outlook and send this into the email as an attachment. I could click file export and I could export the image to the desktop. And I can even select what kind of file type I would like to use. So I'll do a JPEG. I have now saved this image as a JPEG on the desktop. With that loose file, I could then attach it to an electronic claim. I could paste it to a Facebook wall. I could burn it to a disk. I could print it. I could attach it to an email. One of the nicest functions we have in the right click is the preview. When I select preview, we get it says keep on top and I will select that. And now this image will keep on top of all other windows. So like I could go into a Microsoft Word document as an example, and the image stays on top, and I could start typing. We can also do this over any practice management software chart function. So I could be in the chart module of a practice management software and take clinical notes in my chart while I'm looking at the x-ray. Another thing that we can do in Evasoft so I'll come back to the chart view tab as an example here. And I will right click on the film strip. Not only can we float one image like what I just did with the keep on top, but I can put the entire series on top of all other windows. So I will right click down here and I will select the create film strip window. And now my film strip is a loose window. I can come back into Microsoft Word or uh, charting software in any practice management software. And I can look at my entire series as I'm taking notes. I can refer back to my image and move the chart around so I can look at some more x-rays. And I can keep on taking notes in my example here. I am in Microsoft Word, but again, you could be in any account screen, in any practice management software, any electronic charting software, anything like that, really any software. Now, if I wanted to copy and paste an image directly into my Word document, I can do that. I will right click this image and I will select to send the image right into my Word document by hitting paste. The last right click function to show you is in the chart view. In the chart view, if I right click and send the image on a chart position, it will show me every x-ray in that chart position historically for that patient. So for this current patient, Frank Sinatra, I have taken four bite wing shots on that one position. I could now click diagnosis view and send those four x-rays to the diagnosis view tab so I could look at a historic comparison for one x-ray position for that patient's history.